Get ready to create stunning looking image slide shows which will not only captivate your visitors but also enhance overall site's aesthetics. With unique layouts and effortless customizations, you will learn how to make your WordPress site more engaging and visually appealing. So without any further ado, let's dive in and make your site truly stand out with these dynamic sliders. The widget we will be using here is offered by W Design Kit. Speaking in terms of figures, it includes over 2000 pre-designed templates and 100 plus pre-built widgets for Elementor, Gutenberg and Bricks, along with a cloud workspace and much more. We will discuss about more of its features in detail soon, so make sure you watch this video till the very end. Now let's start with the tutorial. Make sure you have installed Elementor and we will also need W Design Kit. So come up here and click add new plugin. Then search for it. And here it is W Design Kit. Simply click on install now. Then activate. Moving ahead to appearance. And here as you can notice, I'm using next a theme. However, feel free to use any other theme as per your preference. Now in order to use this plugin, we will need to make an account with W Design Kit. Simply come here and click on W Design Kit. Next, up here in the header section, click on Login. At the bottom here, it's written don't have an account. Click Sign Up. Now this web page will open up where it's visible that you can sign up with your socials or here after you fill all the details mentioned, simply click on this button. I already have an account so I'll simply click Sign In. And then I will click on Continue with Google. Once you're logged in, you will get to see this kind of interface. It's time to activate our widget, so come up here in the header section and click on Browse Widgets. Now search Sliders. And here it is. Simply download it by clicking on this icon. Now let's make sure it's downloaded by going into the My Widget section. Perfect. Now opening the Elementor editor, here's my page where I have already imported the widget. If you want to do the same, simply come here in the Widgets panel and search Sliders. Then drag and drop it inside the workspace. For now, let's just select the widget from the navigator and under the content tab in here, you will get to see these many customization options. Let's go through all of these one by one. First one is navigation. We've got two styles here that are one and two. I like this one, so let's keep it. Also alignment can be adjusted from here very easily. Moving ahead, it's time to talk about slides. This is the main part of the video, so watch closely. On opening the item box, you will get to see several options to make use of. In media, whatever picture you will upload will be showcased in the banner area of the slider. See? Also, if you want to add some text on this picture, this widget has got that covered as well. Let me quickly add some text and description from a demo document I prepared specially for this project. It's done. You can see how our first slider looks like with some text over it. Now this option here is for button. But you will ask, Kunal I can't see any button on the layout. Well, that's because it's hidden. If you want to make it visible, scroll down a bit and click on this disable buttons toggle. See, it's visible. Now you can customize this button's element from here. Its text can be changed, icon can be replaced or uploaded as well as there is a link field. So you can easily redirect your site visitors onto a specific page with just a click. Though I don't want this button on my slider, so I'll go ahead and turn this disable button option on again. Next, we've got navigation image option. Using it, you can basically fill these small blank boxes down here. Please note that these boxes are clickable and will be used to navigate by your visitors. I'll upload the same image that I uploaded above, but you can feel free to upload any image as per your liking. It's done. All the options are covered. Now it's the same process for the remaining slides. So let me quickly fill up the other item boxes as well with the images and required text. All set. Our sleek looking slider is ready to go online. It's time to update and have our final look. Now 
Now don't forget to explore other amazing features W Design Kit offers. It provides various design assets and resources to create amazing WordPress websites in a matter of minutes. With its 2000 plus page templates, sections and kits, you can import pre-made WordPress websites. It comes with its own power widget builder using which you can convert any custom code to element or widget blocks or bricks elements and not only that as we shared earlier it has its own 100 plus growing collection of pre-made widgets for elementor gutenberg and bricks using w design kit page builder converter you can convert your elementor widget to gutenberg blocks and even bricks elements amazing right lastly for all the power wordpress users who create multiple websites w design kit also comes with its cloud workspace where you can store your created widgets and page sections on the cloud and import on any other website as well as collaborate with your team members. To be honest, you can see me delusional but W Design Kit is the tool which can increase your productivity by 100%. It comes with both free and pro plan. You can check all the details from this pricing page and choose the plan which suits your need. Hope you enjoyed the video. Now if you are curious, be sure to check out our next video where I will show you how you can add an amazing scroll triggered animation to your banners and images making them truly stand out on your WordPress site. Also, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel with the bell icon turned on so that you don't miss any of such amazing videos we keep on adding inside our W Design Kit playlist every week. Until then, keep learning and stay creative.